Greetings all, Vanna here for Virgo's Daily Oracle Message. We're having some fun readings today, Virgo, and I'm enjoying it. Ooh, let's flip it over. Ah, Virgo, your first message is acceptance. Accept that sometimes life is going to take a turn that you are not always going to be able to explain. But everything is a lesson or a blessing. And the hindsight of a situation may come much later, but okay. Purification is also overturned. That must have flipped over around the same time as Starry Night. So purification, yes, you are getting rid of that which does not serve your vessel. I say it every day in my personal life and these readings. Get, spirit, I release that which does not serve my greatest and my highest good. That which is not in line with my soul's purpose is needs to be rid from my vessel. And this will lead you to great success in your life's ventures. This could be in starting your business, writing a book, creating a YouTube channel, or just in anything. This could be being a success and being a parent. This could be a success and just being a happy person. You don't have to go and do something massive like change the world to be a success. If you are a happy person, that's success. And my love, you also have the gifts of magic. You have spirit with you. And please remember that you are magic. Your very existence is magic. Because we are not humans having a spiritual experience. We are spiritual beings having a human experience. Because in my personal thought, this realm is hell. This is where we are punished for the past mistakes of our past lives. This is where we suffer. This is where we hurt. And after we die, we ascend back to source and learn we we don't hold on to those egos and things that we held here that makes us hate, that makes us angry. We don't hold on to that anymore because that is something that only happens here. Because source energy is that of love. Yes. And spirit is giving you a sanctuary through this time. Through figuring out who you are. Please remember to have patience, my love. Because it's not going to come overnight. You're not going to just radically change your life and become a spiritual energetic badass overnight. But you are protected. The spirits of the lands are, are going to protect you because you are growing into something truly beautiful. Virgo, you are amazing. I am... Okay. Okay. This growth that you're doing, or just the success in whatever it is, it may be related to your family. Now, this does not have to be your blood family. If you are in a situation where you just do not want to deal with any of that, I understand entirely. Your family does not have to be, to be your blood. I know the quote is, blood is thicker than water, but that is not the full quote. It is, the blood of the tribe is thicker than the water of the womb. The family that you make is equally, if not more important, than the family you are born into if they are what gives you love. So be playful. Live in your light and you will attract the people that need to be in it. You're, when you vibrate high and you like live in that level of love, your vibe attracts your tribe. So if you're surrounded by shitty people, maybe do a check on yourself and say, like, what about me is attracting these people in? And I know for me, my light is very bright, and it attracts energy vampires like moths. So I have to protect myself and discern who actually gets access to that. And that makes me seem like a very cold and distant person to some people, because I'm not letting them use and manipulate me. You're not selfish. You're not wrong. You're protecting yourself because you are sacred. Have a beautiful day, Virgo.